بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم والصلاة والسلام على رسول الله ربي اشرح لي صدري ويسر لي امري واحلل عقدة من لساني يفقه قولي uh, Brothers, sisters, uh, uh, in today's lesson I would like to show you how we can uh, make detail for uh, column changing dimension okay so when we have a column uh, when we are uh, walking in a um, concrete structure sometimes it need uh, it doesn't need uh, the same sh uh, section for the upper uh, story so we have to change uh, or the designer change the the uh, section uh, the section of the column so we have a, a special detail for that so uh, I will show you how we can uh, detail this in a rabbit so uh, here I have uh, at level one and I will go to with wall uh, column the structure column and as you here I have only a uh, steel column so I will bring a uh, lot family if you go to uh, column we have this column only so structural column so I'll bring this one construction column this one yeah I think is good uh, for me and as you see there is the depth so I will change it to height and the unconnected I will uh, change it to level 2 so uh, just click here now we have uh, this one the column is as you see here is uh, 300 by 300 so I will change this one uh, it's square column so I will re duplicate this one and I will say uh, 500 by 500 just click OK and change this one to 500 and duplicate this one uh, another one for upper upper section let's say uh, 45 by uh, 45 okay so and this one 400 uh, this one. <coughs> okay so select this one and change this one to the column that we selected and we said that we have uh, 500 by 500 so as you hear and go to level 2 after that you go to level 2 and make another column again the same column we want to uh, this time we want uh, this one I mean this one is the same thing no problem uh, of course I'm sorry I did, I did a mistake no problem I will fix it I select this one and change it to the, the section anyhow uh, go to column I'll fix this one later just click like this and escape two times uh, go to 3d select this one and change it back to uh, 500 by 500 as you see here sometimes we, we need this this kind of detail okay this kind of detail so how we can uh, fix this problem or how we can change this one or sometimes maybe if it's edge uh, from one side so how we change it to one side it's pretty easy just go to align and align this one so anyhow so how we we we, we, we select or we, we make uh, this kind of, of uh, detailing uh, go to view or uh, fr uh, from the section to go to section and make a section for that I want to uh, look at it from the section so double click here and I see uh, this one. I'll bring this to the right side. As you see now, we have we don't have any problem with this, and with this we have uh, we want to we or we have to make uh, some kind of detail, which is the maximum is one one to six, uh, the ratio. Okay, so just uh, go to structure, go to cover, and we can select both by pressing control and as you see here we have only 25 but for column we have 40 so just click here and uh, add another one let's say column cover and change this one to 40 uh, which is 4 centimeter uh, again select both of them and click here and select this one so this is the first a step the second step is just uh, go to rebar okay uh, the rebar shape we want to use uh, of course it's it's according to the the, the uh, 
or the position of the, of the column it will change if uh, this uh, the last one uh, it, it should be uh, hook it at, at the top uh, but I don't consider it's uh, the, so I, uh, it's the last one so I will just I need uh, from the here uh, so I will make a straight one so I will choose the straight one as you see here is is uh, uh, through the screen so I'll change the uh, placement method orientation to the parallel to the work plane so as is here now I have this one okay that's very good I have this one and the structure rebar I use for maybe number six or whatever you you have and the detailing can go to with fine or uh, with course whatever you want okay that is very good okay I made for this one but what about the, the last one so I will uh, bring up this one up to the cover of this one up to the cover of this one okay after that what I can do I can just uh, uh, mirror this one of course uh, I can change the layout for this one if uh, uh, this one if I want to three so I will uh, make it with a uh, fixed number let's say three no problem and after that I want to mirror this just like this I mirror this one uh, this one is for here is very good but for this for for the top as you see here it's not good and it's outside the host so the first thing or the best way to just uh, we have to cl click this one and go to edit sketch okay that's very good for uh, editing sketch what we are going to do so just go to SL for splitting this uh, line okay so what I'm doing I'm just to take the dim uh, this dimension as is uh, 51 and uh, bring this one or, um, sorry 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 yeah 51 so what I'm doing I'm just delete this one okay uh, and I will bring another one or make another another line from uh, from this line so what we have we have 51 it's just like this okay so now we have uh, this one for now what I'm going to do what we said we said uh, we have for one degree or oh, sorry just uh, make this one zero we said that the maximum is one to six so I can uh, go with one or with ten whatever no problem this one let's say ten and this should be uh, sixty just like this so how can I do it I can draw a line from this point here now can delete this one it's just for help and I will tr trim and extend this one oh, I'm sorry I used uh, by mistake I used this one yeah it should be like this so just cl click it and click finish contain more than one loop so we see where is where more than one loop uh, yeah as you see here so continue I will delete this line also now as is here we have this kind of cool uh, fillet so just click finish and now you see we have uh, this kind of uh, this one so maybe you are asking me if we, if we go to uh, 3d let's first go to 3d and we see in the 3d view we see how it shows uh, by the way you can select both of the columns uh, and right click override the by element and I want to override the surface transparency to change or change to 80% so just click OK and after that I want to see the, the, the uh, bars in 3D ju just go to uh, select the bars by pre uh, selecting this one and pressing control and uh, select the rest and uh, from the uh, uh, graphics view visibility state just click here and go to uh, view as a solid at 3d is here uh, in a 3d uh, 
a drawing we want to uh, view as solid so just click OK now if we go with fine we see now we we can see this one if we go to shade it again we can see them as you see now we have this cool thing okay uh, maybe you are asking me some question now uh, so how about how about the corner one the corner one so for the co corner if you have corner so we have to divide this into two parts or three parts uh, of course because we have three we have to uh, divide into three parts because we have to uh, rotate this one by uh, 45 degree so it should be or our show so it will be uh, 45 degree from this this corner but I think now it works here as you see yeah what I'm uh, doing uh, what I'm just saying about is this, uh, this one so when 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 if or if we change this one to three parts make this one one as you see now we have only one if we go to top view now we have only one right so as you see here uh, after that we can we can uh, change it but anyhow let me uh, change back to three uh, of course the for this one we we just discuss about this this one as otherwise we what we can do we can go to with uh, the stirrups for that uh, section rebar uh, we use suitable stirrup but we have to change the placement uh, orientation so just when clicking here and now from this one select the, uh, I'm sorry select this one by the way if you don't select this one you see uh, now we, uh, it's here right just by pressing to, uh, tab or you see if there are some, some uh, uh, many overlap things you can just uh, tag it by by uh, tab okay uh, anyhow just single you go to the maximum spacing the maximum spacing will be 200 towards it yeah 200 let's set I'm oh, sorry 200 okay you see now we have uh, this one up to here uh, of course we have one extra so if we want we can just may, uh, bring it up to here and make uh, another one for here you see we learn uh, for this uh, one of course again uh, we go back to the structure rebar and the same procedure for this one and exit uh, the single to the maximum spacing the maximum spacing will be uh, 200 just like before you see now we have this one of course we said uh, we can uh, make another one for this one but I think it doesn't need uh, to waste our time and you learn now how you uh, solve this kind of problem okay so if if as you see here uh, it's outside outside the, the, the this one is inside the uh, the our bar just go to back to the uh, it is sketching it is sketch and you can just bring it uh, a little bit to this direction and you can fix uh, the problem again we have to I think have to another time now it's finished yeah now it's good so uh, this is the detail for today and this is the tutorial for today uh, hope you enjoyed guys don't forget to like and share this video and